Dude, Wizard of Legend 2 is out in early access. It released a few days ago while I was away. I wasn't here for it. I didn't realize it was releasing so soon. I've just completely lost track of time when it comes to the release of this game, but it's here. Now, if you remember a few months ago, maybe you saw, maybe you didn't, I did do a video for a demo that they had released for the game back then. Decent fun, pretty good, liking what I see from the uh, the demo, and I'm looking forward to coming in and seeing how early access goes. Now, the standard, it's early access, expect bugs, expect incompletion, expect things to be a work in progress. But what's not a work in progress is this signature attack, which still freezes the entire screen, which is pretty cool. Now, I've started the game, I've done my, my initial little trial run, I've not done anything besides unlocking one new spell, which I get for free. I've got Flame Breath that I started with, and Ice Blast that I've unlocked. I'll show you the Flame Breath. If you know me, we've had a bit of Wizard of Legend on the channel over the last, like, you know, three years or so. Um, I love the first Wizard of Legend. It's a lot of fun. It's a really good time. In fact, I might use this Flame Breath in a run. It's, it's pretty nice, dude. You see that? How pretty it looks? It looks insane, especially when you're using the, the, you know, big ultimate version of it. Fire effects look nice. Um, I've played the first game all the way through, uh, years ago, and then liked it so much that, you know, I reset my After save data my to come back and do it again. Arcana, I realize one oh, no. Power alone isn't enough. I don't know of legend, if there's an option to turn him off. Of if there is an option, unfold. I couldn't see it. But I'm gonna see if maybe I can. I've gotta find that. Oh, we can knock him into the pit. Get in the pit. Or just die. Fine, so be it. Um, I need to turn off the commentary if he's gonna talk because I'm meant to be talking, not you, sir. Fire. Uh, it's the little, little, I don't know, shaman? What is he? What are we going to call this guy? Is he like a little, little nature shaman? Burn. Yeah, well, nature's got two faces. One is nice and one is fire. Whoa. That's a big boy. Hello, big boy. Can I burn you, please? Actually, we got to get rid of the annoying... Ouch! I dodged in the wrong direction. You want to dodge through big man. Oh, but not before he does his attack. If he does his attack late, he'll catch me. Become the wizard of legend. No, I but need to turn you off. Stands at the end of this. Let me take a look. See dialogue. I don't want to turn all of the dialogue off completely. I just want to turn off the in run commentary. There's backgrounds. What do you mean background audio is is already off? I don't. Hmm. Journey. And only the worthy face I don't think there's a way to turn them off, so they're just going to chat in the back. I either turn off all of the dialogue, which kind of ruins the boss fights and any other instances of speaking. It's either all or nothing, you know, so I'll go all for now. But you let me know if the... If the chatter is too distracting and annoying, we might just have to do away with it, dude. We might have to just tell them to, to be done. Wow, that missed. In the hole! I didn't even notice my signature got maxed out. I've wasted it. I've whole wasted it. Give me. Now what do I get? Resources? I like getting resources. Resources are nice. Resources are good. What's with the flower? Is the flower going to get mad at me? Oh. Flower do indeed get mad at me. Cool. Give me this. More resources. Love it. Can that reactivate? Oh, it can reactivate. Cool. I need to start, like, learning what the traps are like. Squish. So that I can uh, use and abuse the traps to kill my enemies. Now who? Bugs. But I hate bugs. Actually, not only bugs, but an elite shaman guy. And I want to dodge into him. Dodge into him so that his projectiles go past and over me. Knock off his hyper armor. I think that's hyper armor, at least. It looks like hyper armor. Burn. Ooh, get away from that. Okay, there's a lot of them there. That's annoying. No, 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 no. I need to wait for them to fire off their attacks. Because they're going to an assault. Whoa! That backstep almost put me back into harm's way. Do you die from fire? He does die from fire. Oh, that's more shallow than you would think. Gich! I dodged too early. We have to dodge reactively, not predictively. We have to wait until the attack is on its way and then dodge. We dodge to... Uh, too early, we're gonna get sniped. 
Relic altar. Choose a relic. The tiny spirit doll. Max life by 30. The amount scales up with the number of earth I have. I don't have any earth. Killing an enemy reduces the cooldown of a random arcana for one second. Pushing enemies in the pits are rewarded with 200 gold. Destroyed afterwards. Can I do that? Can I get that, please? I've been pushing dudes in pits. I want to push a dude in a pit. That's our next objective. Push a dude in a pit. What's our best means of doing that? Probably the wind attack. My my standard arcana. My uh, my wata that I've got right here. We'll do that. Now. The relics you might while discovered in the trials. Lady. Remnants of a time lady. Magic lady. Lady, now, I don't care. Ma'am. These relics are our last link to the ancient powers. Ma'am. Thank you. While I am trying to remember what in the world I am doing and trying to knock dudes oof, into ravines, which I swear to if there are no more holes, while we do that, let's talk about the elephant in the room. So when I did the, the last video for this, for the demo, the reception was interesting because obviously the team that's making this Wizard of Legend isn't the same team that made the original Wizard of Legend. It's, it's a new team now. And it's had a facelift, as you can see. It is now a very different aesthetic kind of game. It's it's more reminiscent, um, as others are saying in myself. It, it looks a lot more Hades-inspired than it does the original version of the game. That's a lot of... Ah, that's why. Sick. I like that. Oh, that's going to spawn more. Cool. Die. Keeping your health high cool. like that is crucial. Who knew you had the constitution of a stone golem? Thank you. I am... Stony is exactly what I was described as in high school. They said that I was... I was constitution like a stone golem. That's... that's me. Do I want to... I don't think I've got enough money to even entertain this right now. I could buy health. I can't really buy much or anything else. I'm gonna push a dude into a hole and get that cash payout, though. That's what I need to do. Now, going back to the aesthetics of the game. I've seen... Um, the game is currently a little bit mixed on Steam. As of playing this, it's it's got mixed reception. It's been out for about, what, five, six days? Um, as of me playing it. Oh, I can't. All of these dudes are either airborne or, or aren't mobile. Like, I can't move them. I want to push a dude into a hole. What if I do this? Oh, I can do that. Cool, dude. Cool. Squish, squish. I need to bring enemies to this room if I can. And have them go into this hole. So far, this is the hole. But yes, going back to it. Mixed reception. Um... People aren't entirely pleased with... I think it's just like early access stuff. It's buggy, a few crashes here and there, stuff like that. Things that I don't necessarily... Oh my goodness. A chance. They went over. They went over. Does that count? Does that count? I saw dudes fall in. Or were they dead before they fell in? No. Come over here. Man, this isn't going to hang on. They're dying too quickly. I need new dudes. Yes. Wait, no. This is bad. It's more of the same. Hmm. Hang on. I need to... I need to thin the herd a little bit. There we go. That counts. That counts. Money! It counts! Hang on. My signature is about to expire. We can't waste this opportunity. It's too good. Damn it! That's gonna ruin it for me. No! Fine. Oh, come here. Come here. Come here. Please. Please. Please, I beg, I beg, I beg, please. Oh, I think I just hurt him too much. I need you to come, come over here. Oh. That counts. What? No, pay me. Can I get to my thing? Not back to hub, not back to, yeah, I want it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Push 10. Oh, it's 10 enemies. I thought it was just one enemy. That would have been way too easy. Well, I've pushed a, a several, several amount. Let's push more. Come over here. Come over here. We just need to push a few more. I don't know if there's a, a counter. Was there Was there a way to see on here? Oh my god, that's not pausing my game. I'm an idiot. Hang on. Hang on. Don't hit me, dude. There. More going in the hole. We're gonna do it. I'm gonna get this payout. I'm gonna get this payout. Whether, whether they like it or not, they can't stop me. It's gonna happen. Another ravine. Go. That's got to count, right? That's. I please tell me that counts. Oh, hang on. Let me get rid of the range dudes first. No, you lads are going in the drink. Burn. Come over here. 
over here. Now, while I'm doing this, so there's been a lot of scrutiny over the game so far. One, the aesthetic is different. It feels different. People don't like it. The ones who are saying it's bad don't like it, right? So it's 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 very much a, uh, you know, it's either a thing that you're okay with or a thing that you're not okay with. And some people don't like it. Some people are fine with it. It's up to you. Personally, I do think a small amount of the original charm is a bit lost on this. It doesn't feel the same as the first one, but it doesn't have to be the first one. It is a sequel. It doesn't have to be Hades 2. Hades 2 feels very safe in contrast, just as another game that has a very similar aesthetic. It feels very similar to Hades 1, and for some people, that's a good thing. For some, it's like, ah, I really wish they'd been a bit more daring and tried a new thing here and there and, you know, mixed it up a bit more from the first game. Um, and this definitely does that, it mixes things up, but once again, it comes down to your preferences. This aesthetic may be up your alley, it may not. Um, obviously having, you know, the character dialogue and people talking to you with the, the artwork on the side, it's, it's all very, very, um, Hades-esque, right? Perish. Ooh, they all activate at once? Mean. Um, but it's up to you, I mean, I'm not gonna tell you if it's a good thing or a bad thing, it just depends. Um, as far as the the reception online for the game, as to, you know, bugs and issues like that, I don't care. I'm When I pick up an early access game, I expect it. Anyone who's bought an early access game and then writes a negative review because they're getting crashes or, or balance issues or, I don't know, uh, the boss hit me really hard and I died and I couldn't do anything about it, game's not balanced, I hate this. I mean, it's early access, dude, what do you expect? This That's the whole point of, of did I get my thing? I did! I got my payout! I didn't even notice, dude. I was too busy talking. Good, we got the payoff. No more knocking into holes. I was just noticing I have a lot of money. Um, yeah, like, like I'm trying to say, trying to allude to, I don't, ooh, I don't care about the early access grievances. I care about the longevity. Oh my god, okay, okay. Too many, too many range bros. Too many range bros and not enough dodges for me. I need to... Go! Okay, this elite skeleton with the shovel? Shovel, bro? I'm gonna have words with you. Can I? Yes, I can. Cool. I was gonna say, can I, like, just piss you off? Where are they coming from? Are they just spawning because this guy's not dead, or are they spawning for another reason? I don't know. Oh, I staggered him. I forgot, I forgot I could stay. His armor's off. I was treating him. There we go. I was treating him like he was still hyper armored. Son of a bitch. Interrupted the study. Yes, I, I, yes, I do do that thing. I want to go back to the shopkeeps now because I made a lot of money. Wait, is this the one I want to go to? No, wait. That one, please. Thank you. All right, you sell spells, right? The Aromancer's Grasp, Inferno Barrage. Barrage Ward. Is that upgraded? Hence the gold outline, like it's already been powered up a little bit. Form a water fire which shoots fiery projectiles at nearby enemies. So I've got a turret that I can set down. That's going to replace my windy kick attack that I've got right now. Fissure Slam. When pushing enemies back, they are slammed to hit a wall. Okay, so it's it's uh, collateral damage. It's, you know, knock them into something. Shielded Submerge Strike. Submerge yourself in the ground, propelling yourself with a watery current. At the end of the ability, or by recast, emerge with a forceful war. It's dive. It's dive. We're, we're Pokemoning right now. And we become airborne. Well, we damage airborne enemies that don't take damage from grounded stuff. I mean, I might go and take a look at the item stuff first. I might buy the Barrage Ward, though. I'll still have 270 left. Let's do that. I want to... I want to... Yeah. Give me that Ward. Oh, it's the extra one. I forgot. I've got extra slots. I'm an idiot. I'm just, I'm thinking about, you know, that I don't have the unlocked stuff yet. I think I have to, like, my brain is telling me, you've got to unlock that. No, no, I can just do it. Nice. Very cute. I like it. That didn't last very long at all. Damn. Okay. We'll see if I like it. Doubles any max life boost received from other relics. From other relics. Maybe I spent my money a little bit too quickly. Killing enemies using signature increases its damage. That's my flame breath. Water shield that orbits you and negates enemy projectiles. Dashing through enemies will damage them. I kind of like that. And it's an earth anklet. Sassy. I like it. Used wet soap. Chance of evading by 10%. I like that. Can I see that somewhere? Where do I see my, my stats break down? My evade chance is 5. A 15% chance to evade. You know what? Give me the soap. 
I'll take that, dude. I'll take the soap. I like the soap. Can I get back up to the top? Thank you very much. So ice, babe. This is where I might die. I died when I got to the first uh, mini boss fight, or the first, you know, wizard fight, because I don't know their move sets yet. But I remember my ice queen. She was difficult in the first game. She was probably one of the ones people didn't like fighting because she was tough. Damn, the ice skates, very pretty. Do you dare face all my mysteries? Miss mm. Cold will bring tears to your eyes. <laughs> all right all right that's foul whoa 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 they circle cool i'm just getting a feel for her attacks right now yo she's an elven ring boss walk into it cool we can avoid that do i have to kill that no, it just breaks on its own. Lady! Oh my god. Oh my god, lady. Lady! Lady! She doesn't want to come into... I need to put it closer to her. Wait, she's she's been snapped. Free fire at her face. Oh, she just does this, dude. Okay, 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 okay. Ow! Ow! Bitch! Okay, we'll do fire breath and then end. Ow! And then. Ooh! End with the wind kicks. There we go! Down you go, lady. Took half my life. Oh, oh, oh. I may seem calm and serene, but my depths are fathomless. Dive with caution. A little bit more sexual than I would have expected, lady. Thank you. Arcane Chromo. A Chromo? Damn, dude, we're becoming extra human. I'm getting more chromosomes as we, as we play. <laughs> How cool would that be for an idea for a game? You beat bosses and you, like, you add chromosomes to your DNA. Like like a like a biology rush. Like you start off as like this little little amoebic entity, and as you like kill and devour other creatures, your biology gets added to, and you like gain chromosomes, and you become a higher entity. And the point is to become God. Damn, someone, dude, someone, at least give me royalties. <laughs> Wielded by ancient master wizards, these forgotten variants are altered versions of Arcana. They offer new and more potent magic, empowering the wielder to be overcome the trials. Variants can only be discovered during runs and are lost upon the wizard's defeat. These are my upgrades. So I kind of want to upgrade my Dragon Breath, because it is like the most important attack for me. It is my signature. Spawn a wide wave of fire that damages enemies, the waves destroy my projectiles, and create fire sparks. I like that it beats other projectiles. I do like that. Ends with a leap attack that sends enemies airborne. Cool. Shoot a fireball that returns to you. That is okay. No, do, do the signature. It looks a little bit bigger. I think the destruction of projectiles and maybe the damage is the most noticeable thing about it, but it does look a bit bigger. Not insanely large, but it is nice. Oh yeah, oh, oh, that's very nice, actually. I have spoken too soon, my friend. I've, I've, yeah, that's very nice. No, get kicked in the head. Burn. I should have put my, my turret down. I'm just, I'm checking out my new signature, dude. It's pretty nice. Hello, spiders. You may die. You may get... Uh, bro, did that hit him at all? Hmm. I don't know if that turret... He just casually walked through all of that. I don't think he... Oh, these haven't got any gold in them? Are some of these pots duds? Just gonna be money and stuff. Right? Oh, thank you. I do like the money, though. Burn. Knock his shield out of his out of his hands. There we go. Oos, oos, oos. Wata. I do like this wind attack. This this wind kick. What's it called? What's it called? Flying kicks? I love this attack. It feels really nice just diving in. And wait, can I Can I access a larger view? If possible. 
of the mini map? I don't know if I can. I wanted to see if I can make the mini map bigger. I've hit every button on my on my controller for the most part. I feel like I'm going the wrong way. Oh. Oof! Fella walked into harm's way. Burn. Die. Oh, not you again. Oh, I couldn't put it down fast enough. It's a bit slow. Okay, only set that down when we've... Ow! When we've got a chance. Breathe on him. Only set it down when we've got it. Dude, I like the scorch marks left on the ground. That's cool. I'm going to run back. I feel like I've missed that, that other pathway. This way it's going a lot longer than I expected. We go through up to here. Oh my god, it was... No, no, no. There's enemies here. Not wasted. There are enemies. There are problems to be dealt with. Thank you. That gets me stuff, something. That helps. I do like that we still have the uh, the sprint from the first game, where if you run uninterrupted for long enough, you break into a dash. To help get from A to B, we don't have a universal teleport, I don't think. You have to use the actual teleport location. You can't just like open the map and say, go here, I've been here before, go here now. Hello, who are you? What do you sell? Ah, you're the trader. I don't know if I want to trade any. My flame ward looks like it's already been upgraded to fire out a multitude of attacks in a big wide... Can I put this down? Is it going to hit the dummy? Okay, it is. It is doing its job. I just don't know if it's... Oh, I mean, the burning effect is good. I don't know if it's doing its job well. I'm on the fence about it. Let's just put it that way. I might need to, to rethink the turret strategy. Normally, turret strategy is a golden strategy, and turrets are normally like... A fantastic idea, but maybe this turret breaks that rule. Burn. I love that this signature is on a relatively short cooldown, though. It's like, what, three seconds? Two and a half seconds? I doesn't feel like that long. Get kicked in the head. Put this down. Eh. He did have a shield out, which is why he didn't take much damage. Still. Still. I'm reconsidering this turret. But I've got it now. May as well stick with it for a bit. Uh, yeah. Just you watch. Someone's going to be in the comments and be all like, Beals, I've done turret builds. Let me tell you right now, they're busted. They're OP. They're amazing. Here's my, my three-step plan to make that flame turret the most broken and powerful thing on the planet. Step one, get this really niche item that makes projectiles inflict like poison and other status effects. That way, whenever the turret hits a dude, you get like a rainbow of debuffs on the enemy. It's goaded, Beals. Trust me on this. And that's exactly what it's going to be like. There'll be a dude who just has everything already mapped out. And he knows, dude. He knows. He knows exactly what he's doing. Uh, shout outs. Leave, leave a comment if you're that guy. And don't you lie. I know the kind of guy that you are. I know who you are. You just let me know. I love the scenery. Everything looks so pretty. You know? It's simple, but it's it's a pretty type of simple. You know, it's not too overstated, but not too understated. It's kind of nice. I'm looking at all the little mushroom jelly blob things on the side. It's cool, dude. It's very cool. I need... Huh. I was going to say, I need big room. My signature is not charging up fast enough. I want my signature to be used. Get kicked. Here we go. Yo, bro. What if I just do this to you right now? Oh, good. I don't take damage when he does that. Ow! Here, get kicked in the head. Oh, he still has hyper armor. He doesn't care. He doesn't care. I should have known. Big boy don't care. Summon it. Here we go. I didn't need that, dude. I did not need that in my life. <sighs> Could have lived without that. Hello! So you're all here to try and get me to change what I'm doing. The wind carries you swiftly to your opponent, where you unleash a flurry of punches and kicks. So I teleport forward a little bit is what you're saying. I do like that, and it is upgraded. I should do that. I should do that, but I have a little bit of money. I don't have enough to buy a lot of stuff. Vampire eyeglasses! I can get my Alucard on. I don't have much crit synergy, though. Please tell me we've still got the item sets from the first game where I get an Alucard skin. 
where I get the teeth and the glasses and it becomes a new outfit for me and I get like a whole new paired effect. For five seconds, you have a doubled chance of evading the next attack. That's pretty good, actually. That synergizes well with my my current setup by having 15% dodge chance. It's not like foolproof, but it's a star. Mm. I'm really tempted to get those glasses, but I do not. I've, I've gone for more dodge than crit and I can't really force it. If I go back to where that crystal is, I thought I had to do more to get into this. I just activate it, right. Oh my god. Is that going to activate the trap? Oh, there we go. I'm just trying to, like, deal with all the problems that are around. Do that. Get them burning. There we go. There we go. Cool. I can enhance an arcana. Ooh, my fireball is free. Wait, I've got 303. I could buy the... Oh, but I wouldn't... It'd be a waste. I was going to say I could buy the glasses for 200. No, well, the glasses, the glasses are 100. I can buy an item for 100 and a spell for 2. But if I upgrade my fireball to get more attack speed... Crit... Wait a minute. If I give my flame water 20% crit chance and I get it to hit the enemy, the Alucard glasses proc... 20% crit chance isn't small, but it doesn't hit very easily. The flying kicks hit a lot more easily against enemies. Mm. It's 10%. It'd be 15% total versus 25% total. That's a big boost to crit. I'm going to do it, dude. I'm greedy. Give me the flame ward upgrade. Get me to here. Take me back. Glasses. I know you're mad. I know you're seething right now. You're going, Beals, please. This is a dumb meme. This is a bad idea. I know it's a bad idea. The hag? We fought the hag, didn't we? In the demo? This big hag dude thing? I, I vaguely remember this guy. But if he's a big dude, I could drop this turret and there's a big hitbox. I'll get lots of hits. Small child. I vaguely remember you. Ooh, did we have that cool stylized font before? All right. All right. All right. I'm a broken. Go in. Go in. Drop it. Yep. Do I want to stand on that? Probably not. Holy shit, dude. Oh, oh, thank you. Fourth hit, fourth hit, added a new one. Two, three, four. Cheeky. Two, three, four, refire. Careful. One, two, three, four. Breathe fire. Drop this down. I'm not seeing my healing either as well. I'm, I'm not... Wait. Weakened. Can I get my breath on you from there? I can. A bit risky though, because there's a lot of rock stuff. Jeez, dude. And then the jump. Slam. Two... Three, four. This is an awkward spot to sit in. I'm gonna have to look back in editing, dude. I am literally not looking at the healing that I may or may not be getting from crits. I'm not looking at all. One, two, three, four. Thank you. Dodge that icky. Drop it. Do that. We are getting hits. It is, dude, bigger hitbox. I've got 107 life. What did I start with? I definitely took more yes. damage than I healed, didn't I? I knew that big bad Bahador would have nothing on your skill. Bahador? My skill and might. I've slain the Bahador. <laughs> Yay, I'm moving on to a statue. Yippee, I love moving on to the statue. Ah, uh, this was my choice, right? Where I get to... 
It looks like they're both healing. Ah, heal or max life. So recover 150 points or increase my max by 75. My reward for not sucking. Do I, I might, dude, I'm going to be greedy. I'm going to take this and assume that I can heal back. I'm just going to, nah, I'm doing this. You think? You think you know me? You don't know anything about my, my lizard of wedge in strategy. This is why we've done this, dude. Because my, my turret has 25% effective crit chance, I hope. And my, my, my glasses, it's going to happen. I'm at 148 life. I need to test this. I have not healed once yet. <laughs> Don't. Okay, these guys fly. Hmm. They fly and they're spawning. If I come over here and do this. I got a heal. I healed one life. Look at that. Look at dirt. It's working. It's paying off already. I healed two. I healed two. Bruh, you have no idea. My strategy is foot. Oh, shit, shit. You're underground. You're underground. You can't get to me. You can't get to me. Disgusting creature. Perish. Fireball. Fireball. Scorpion. Squish. Oh, dude, my strategy is immaculate. Don't. I don't like it, dude. I don't like how you do that. Wait, wait, wait. Drop it, drop it. Fire, hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him. I'm at 151. Dude, I've still got a 5% base crit chance. You gotta remember that, right? Like, I have a chance just to heal back and be awesome on my own. I don't even need to worry that much. Like, no stress. Oh, they attack twice. You guys are, like, more elite than elite. My signature! Quick, quick, quick! I gotta find enemies, enemies, enemies! You! Perish. Was that it? That was it? I, I, anyone who was here, I've eradicated them all. I'm at 152. I am... Oh, this healing is so slow. I need... I need more multi-hit attacks to help. I need more base crit chance. You. The Jin's right hand fights beside you. It won't aggro enemies. A pet? I get a friend? All standards have their cooldowns reduced. That's kind of nice. Melee has an additional 10% crit chance. Is nice. The only melee I've got, I think, is the wind kicks. If I'd upgraded the wind kicks, I could have taken this and gotten a combined 20% damage. 20% crit boost, but don't worry about it. All of your air damage by 15%. It's really trying to make me do the air stuff. Your dragons deal more damage. I don't think I have any dragons, technically. Although, is this considered a dragon? It's just, a, it's not like, it's a flame breath, but the dragons are like, you summon the dragon to like fly around like the water dragons, I think, in the first game. You can still get in this one where it flies around and it does stuff. I believe. I'm waiting for you to attack. There. Be hit. What happened? Bro, I got ripped off. What happened to my turret? Did they break it? Aw, oh, man. Hell, man. Wait, could I use this to farm? Let me just sit down right here. Come on, man. I need you to land crits. Oh, maybe I can't land crits and heal off of the guys at a summit. That looks bad. That looks really bad. It is really bad. I was debating if I do like a dash forward into a wind kicks, I'd go over the second trap, but I just fall back into the first trap. So it's not really a... Hello? Are you a summoner type of guy? Looks like you are. Uh, can we not? Let's say we did. Okay, so you do like one big cheeky swing. Ow! Dude, it hurts! Okay, dick. Okay, dick. Ow! Okay, dicks. I want to break that egg. Oh my god, the eggs. The eggs, dude. I need to kill him. Wait, here's my chance. Lovely. Oh, 
I need to wait and save my dash for that thing coming down. Okay. Eggs dealt with. Hang on, drop this. Then do this. That should kill him, right? Easy. Easy. Taken care of. I'm using my big spells on the on the eggs, but I need to be saving them for the dude. I need to cleave. Don't like that attack. Oh! Nice. Oh, I didn't dodge it. My, my, my recovery. I got confused. I got confused. He's got a funny sound. Oh, we staggered him. We staggered him. We staggered him. Get him now. Get him. Get him. Breathe. Rar. Yes. Give me healing or something. I'm dying, dude. Revenge. You get 10 gold. So if I get hit and I hit a dude, I get money. That's kind of nice. Increase your damage by 10% when your life is below half. Increase movement speed by 10%. Ooh. Money is power. <laughs> money is power. Give me cash. Crits. I need crits out here. Shit. Can I break these? No. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Okay, fella. Die. Don't do that. It's kind of funny how I've got a revenge thing that, that literally requires me to get hit to get money, which I would normally say is a bad thing. You don't want stuff that requires you to take damage because that implies that you're playing bad to begin with and are getting hurt more. But... But if I have Vampiric healing on my side, who cares, right? Because I'll heal that damage back in theory. Just not quite in practice, I dare say, but in theory, I've created an infinite money glitch. <laughs> not really. Um, I'm not worried about new spells. I could get one more new spell for my last slot by the looks of it, which I kind of should get another signature. So... Air dragons. Th these are the dragons around the wizard that block projectiles. Damage enemies. Cool. If I can save up enough cash, I might buy air dragons. But I just, for some reason, dude, call me crazy. I don't think I'm going to end up getting that money. It's missing! I've seen fireballs go literally through... Oh, but I can hit through the wall. I'm seeing fireballs go through them and it's not hurting them. I don't understand. Am I dumb? Dude! That's too many, too many attacks coming in at different timings. Burn. Shit. That hurt like hell. 30% damage to afflicted enemies. Afflicted just means that it's already burnt. 10% more crit chance on my basic fireball. I can't help it, dude. It's crit chance. I need the, the built-in crit. I need the built-in. I can get my map up. Hang on, let me take a look. Where do I need to go? <laughs> left. I need to go to the left. Come through here. Uh, and we didn't go down here, did we? No, I did not. No! Man! I need more healing. You know, it was not worth coming down here for that because I'm being chased. Help me. Um, where have I not been to now? Besides down these stairs that I don't want to go into. That looks like it. I think I just have to go into what looks like poison hell. All right, get me down here. Ah, uh, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. Yo! Please chill. Okay, big fella. I see, I, ah, I see. Shit. Oh my God, that attack is wild. It goes so wide. No. Oof.
God! I need that healing tomorrow, please. Yesterday, preferably also. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. They're, they're lunging. They're all lunging. There's a thing over here. What is it doing? Ah! Breathe on them! There's another one over here! I think I need to lure my... Oh, eat shit. Oh, eat shit. Oh, eat shit. Eat shit. No. Thank you. Look, I'm not going to say that my chances of survival are bad, but they're also not good. Wait, I found the exit, but there's also a, there's a there's a there's another pathway just down. Can I teleport down here? I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to. Oh, oh, it's that one. OK, uh, I have to walk back down. Let me just build a run real quick. If I die to that, I'm gonna be not pleased. Oh my god, don't do this to me. Fine, do it. Fellas. Oh, is that it? Of course it's not! Ah, oh. ah. Oh. Okay, the minuscule amount increase your damage by 10. That's a lovely trinket. I am not going to get to benefit it much. And my signature is about to run out. Piss! Everything went bad. Is there another pathway down here I'm meant to go? Back to here. I forgot all about my... No, I got a boss, dude, and it's a new guy. Or it's it's the lightning, dude. I don't know. I'm 55. I'm dead, dude. I'm dead. All right, it's okay. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. He's not going to be tough. He's the easy pushover. Super easy, man. Look at him. Super simple. You think you can match my lightning fast pace? I'll leave you in the dust. I hate him. Bro! Okay, he's very quick. Don't like that. Don't. Next time, be quicker, be sharper. Mm. Strike like lightning. Okay. Okay. Fine. <laughs> Fine. We go back and we unlock stuff. We go back and power up. We we did fine. I got I got you know some distance. Ignore all of this. Wait, except you. What are you oh doing? Hi, you're one of the chosen wizards, huh? I'm Ollie, and I'm in charge of the task board. You know, contracts, challenges, the fun stuff. Complete them, and bam, rewards. Oh, and guess what? You've already completed one. Attended the trials. Easy peasy. Claim your reward. Oh, thank you. Deal 5,000 damage with your basic. I, but what do you mean? Have these not all been here? I've definitely done at least, you know, a couple thousand in that. I've also defeated Bahadur. Uh, so these weren't all available until after that run. 50 enemies using necro traps, homing projectile. Play with a friend. <laughs> Stop the impossible task of having a friend. All right, so using my resources, we bought two more standard spells and a relic to give me more max life to make it easy to start grinding this out. The first is a water dragon attack, the Breakers of Tiamat, which I believe... Nope, that's very different to what I remember. I thought it was going to be the summoned water dragons. But then again, that was a signature. That is nice, though. It's kind of good. A little bit of pushback, you know, a little boom, a little pow. I can breathe fire at him and then do it. There's a lot of dragon aesthetic going on right now. Although I don't know if any of these are considered dragons. We'll see. Also, Blazing Whip. I have no idea what this does. Oh, it's like a quick... I've got like two charges, like a one-two. So I can burn him, I can go... Uh, uh. That's kind of... Ooh. It also builds a ton of meter. Dude, look at the meter generation. Look at my, my standard, right? My, my, my standard spell. It's all of them. There's a little bit of meter gen. You know, it's okay. It's fine. Come back. The double whip. That's huge. That's actually insane. From empty? 
We're bit, dude, that's like a quarter of my bar every time. That's We're using this. We are 100% going to be using the Flaming Whip in the next run. And maybe change over to the Ice Blast. I've also got a new basic. We've got Earth Knuckles. This will be my loadout for the next one. Big punchy, look at the damage on that. Big punchy hands. The freeze, the whip. Overall first impressions, everything here feels good. I'm not going to agonize over the early access stuff like I said earlier, but it is a new direction for the series. It looks different and it feels different. The original game was very unique and I've still not found many games that come close to emulating the, the pacing, the speed and the combat style of the first one. The combat style in this one is also somewhat different um, with a lot of the pacing and how you actually attack enemies and how the elite enemies fight you. It, it isn't quite the same. Um, it definitely is a lot more Hades inspired with the dodging and whatnot, but it does feel um, slower than Hades, like it's trying to retain some more identity by not just being a dash fest where you just dash and spam one attack. Having other spells and different things to mix in between is nice. I just need to unlock more spells to really get that diversity going and to get the synergies going because initially you're not going to have a lot that you can work with. So we need to get more spells unlocked. But with all of that said and done, I got to get out of here. I hope you guys have enjoyed Wizard of Legend 2 and I'll see you all again next time. Have a good one.